So what motivates me as a teacher is I'm an intervention specialist and I, um, I've done that for all my 26 years. And I love the challenge of helping a student who struggles to succeed. We have to come up with all kinds of strategies to help them feel successful, but at the same time, um, help their self-esteem. You know, a lot of them, especially when they come to the high school, they've been trying so hard all these years. And they want to be successful and they want to learn more. And um, it's a challenge to help them, but we, we are real respectful, or I like to be respectful of their self-esteem. And just, you know, watching them grow, they come here at a certain level, and we give them the tools to help them get to the next level, and then get ready for life after high school. So it's really a cool time when you see these freshmen come really nervous, and then by the time they leave, our goal is that they leave confident and excited about the new opportunities after high school. Uh, Teresa Replogle is, is such a worthy candidate for, for this award. She's a humble educator, she's a dedicated educator, she's a hard-working educator. Um, you know, she just has the interests of every single kid in mind and can personalize uh, what's going on for the kids um, consistently, you know, day in and day out. Uh, she's here, you know, sometimes I feel like I have to run her out of the building at night and on the weekends she's always here working. She just is incredibly dedicated and, and in highly effective of working with every kid. So just really proud of her and grateful that she is employed here and that is a part of our team. It's not like anybody says you've got to be better every day. You just feel like you need to be. And we do that for the kids and the community. I think um, we would not be who we are and the kids would not be who they are without mom and dad. Their support and their expectations for us to help their kids be successful. 